across the world, you also you, you tie in religion and mm. how people have for, for centuries used selected texts, just like people in the South did 50, 60 years ago, to justify racial discrimination. Exactly. Now you talk about religious texts, selected texts being used to justify rape, slavery, honor killings, and one abuse after another against women. Well, the fact is that I, I, have, I happen to be a Christian, and Jesus Christ was a very uh, wonderful leader who never discriminated in any word or action against women. And women actually played a very important role in his ministry. Extremely so. And, but with the writings of St. Paul, you can selectively take verses out of the Bible, and, and you can justify women not being able to be priests and so forth. So the Catholic Church and the Southern Baptist Convention and others quite often say, well, uh, women are not qualified to have an equal role in the service of God as men. And of course, men all over the world take this as kind of a proof that they can abuse their wives or pay less pay, you know. Isn't it amazing you as a, as a Sunday school teacher for 70 years, <laughs> right. I, I'm always fascinated and a bit disturbed by people that will